50 million dollars, 100 million, 200 million dollars. No, that's not how much you can earn in VFX industry. Those are the staggering movie budgets these days. But how does all that money translate to salaries of people without whom those movies would not exist? We'll have a look at salaries of VFX artists. Any artist or creative person knows how rewarding the work itself can be. However, it's a bit difficult to pay your bills with satisfaction. And figuring out the financial value of your work can be tricky, especially in VFX industry where you might be required to move not just between cities, but also between countries. I'll present monthly salaries for different VFX specializations like animators, compositors and 3D artists, divided by countries in which the industry is concentrated. The values are based on anonymous polls among artists and have been averaged. This will not give you a precise amount, as they depend on multiple factors, but it will present a range of possible income in the VFX industry. Let's start off with animators and their salaries in the United Kingdom. Here, for an entry-level position, you can receive around £2,000. And senior artists can expect around £7,500. For the same position in Germany, you would receive €2,500 as a junior and around €6,500 as a senior. In Canada, which is a huge VFX hub, junior animators are paid around 3,000 Canadian dollars and salaries of senior artists are around 9,000 Canadian dollars. In the United States, salaries vary from 4,000 to 9,000 US dollars. And in Australia, animators can get from 4,000 to 10,000 Australian dollars. Now we can make a similar comparison for 3D artists. In the UK, a junior 3D artist can expect around £2,000. And that salary can go up to about £7,500 for seniors. In Germany, it's €2,000 for juniors and around £6,000 for experienced artists. Canadian VFX companies offer around 3,500 Canadian dollars to junior 3D artists and that goes up to around $7,000. In the US, the range is from 3,000 to 9,000 US dollars and in Australia, it's 3,000 to 8,000 Australian dollars. Compositing is another important part of VFX creation. And compositing artists can earn from around 2,500 to 8,000 pounds in the UK. In Germany the values look similar, 2,500 to 8,000 euro. Compositors in Canada can expect 2,000 Canadian dollars for juniors and around 8,000 for senior artists. In the US the values shape from 3,000 up to $10,000. And Australian companies offer from 3.5 to around 11,000 Australian dollars for compositors. All presented amounts are before tax, and both lower and upper values have been averaged, which means that theoretically the salaries can be even higher. So, as you can see, VFX artist salaries are far from astronomical movie budgets. However, it's still good money. You just need to remember that it depends on many factors, like your experience, company, country, whether you'll be an employee or a freelancer, and of course your negotiation skills. But more importantly, you can earn decent money while doing the job you like. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe for more videos about VFX and VFX history.